Yo, what's going on guys? Mush back at it with another video. I want to give you guys a heads up on an absolutely fantastic humble bundle that just went live. The Bandai Namco Fights, uh, Frights, and Fantasy Bundle. A lot of good stuff in this bundle. Highly, highly recommend you to check it out, so we'll talk about that. And then also, a uh, big game coming out tomorrow that I know a lot of you guys are excited for. Lords of the Fall, and the reviews are getting posted right now, and they are looking fairly strong. And if you want to get the game a little bit cheaper, that option is available with our good friends over at Green Man Gaming, but we'll get to that in a second. First of all, the Humble Bundle, Bandai Namco Bundle, is live right now. It's 10 bucks, and the bundle is stacked. It gets you Tekken 7, Code Vein, which Code Vein is a game that goes for like 8 to 10 bucks alone, so that already covers the cost of the bundle. The MSRP, I believe, for Code Vein is still like 60 bucks, which is wild. It shouldn't be that, but whatever that is the case katamari damashi reroll god eater 3 is in there tales of Vesperia definitive edition which is another game that still goes for a hefty price point dot hack gu last recode which i'm actually playing through this right now uh i just completed volume one like i completed these games several times uh before but uh, one of my uh favorite jrpg series like i'm comfortable in saying that even though i'm also comfortable in saying that those games have a lot of shortcomings and uh with them being ps2 era jrpgs they do show their age but they have great stories soundtracks are great and uh certainly would give those a playthrough and then pac-man museum plus also available with this bundle a lot of good stuff like code van tales of Vesperia, dot hack those three for jrpg fans are great tekken 7 i mean like i don't know how many people are trying to get into tekken 7 at this stage especially with tekken 8 right around the corner but that's still a decent offering god eater 3 also a pretty good offering and katamari damashi not bad either you also get a couple coupons tales of arise 25 percent off coupon and one piece odyssey 50 percent off coupon i don't really see you know people taking advantage of those just because those games go on sale all the time for those percentage offs and i don't believe it's stacked so take that for what you will as always with humble you get to choose where your money goes to charity humble the publishers or uh you can kick back me a couple cents or a couple bucks if you do want i'll leave my humble link in the description box below click that and then click the adjust donation button and uh you can adjust it to your heart's content uh moving on from that lords of the fallen is officially out tomorrow and i do want to give a mention that that game is on sale over at our good friends at green man gaming for 49 dollars and 19 cents over ten dollars off from the from the regular price if you are an xp member the console version is actually 70 bucks so you're saving quite a lot uh Pretty solid reviews thus far. It looks like the Metacritic isn't quite as good as Lies of P, which was kind of the concern I had. I mean, there's a lot of Souls likes coming out, and Lies of P just came out, but we'll see how this one turns out from a commercial standpoint. 76 right now for the PC Metacritic score. What I've heard is from the console side of things, there are some performance issues. So hopefully you have a decent PC and you can, uh, you know, run this game fairly well. The aesthetics and the design of this game is fantastic. So I'm excited to check this one out, even though I'm not crazy about Souls likes. For some reason, I play like 90% of them and I end up, you know, usually enjoying them, even getting uh, my butt whooped most of the times. But yeah, 49.19 on that that over at GMG. But that's going to do it for me. Again, the Bandai Namco Fights, Frights, and Fantasy Bundle is excellent for all that content for 10 bucks. Definitely give that a look. You're going to get quite a lot of value there. And Lords of the Fallen, 18% off for $49.19. Check that out. Links in the description box below. That's going to do it for me. Let me know all of your thoughts in the comments section down below. And as always, guys, thanks for watching, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Hey, what's going on, guys? Mush here again. Hope you enjoyed the video. As you guys might know, YouTube's notification system is sometimes a little bit wonky, even if you're subscribed to the channel. Maybe you're not abundantly aware that I uploaded a video to remedy that situation. Make sure you hit the bell notification button. This way, whenever I upload a new video and I try to upload as consistently as possible, you will be notified directly of the upload and you can watch it as soon as it goes live. I would really appreciate if you guys hit that button so you can stay up to date with all of the content I'm posting. But as always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.